I've been wanting to do a show about school lunches for a while. The first thing you need is a good lunch box. Find one that your child will be able to open all by themselves. We found that doing prep work the night before helps cut down on the morning chaos. Use ice packs to keep your food fresh. Make sure you put them in the freezer the night before. Before school, I try and feed my kids healthy food. This yogurt is super high in protein, and if I top it with honey or agave, my kids love it. It also gives us time to make a proper breakfast and their lunch. My husband is in charge of making the kids lunch. This is a great way for dads to help out. We have a simple program for the school lunch that basically follows the food pyramid. The main dish should be protein based, and here are a few of our favorites that I hope inspire you. Hard boiled eggs, egg salad sandwich, or a slice of quiche are also good ideas. You can substitute meat for any veggie item, but just make sure you use an ice pack. Leftovers are great, especially pizza. A classic cheese sandwich is a favorite, and so is peanut butter and jelly or peanut butter, honey, and banana. My kids always eat whatever dairy item I put in their lunchbox. Growing bodies need calcium. I make sure my kids eat fruits and vegetables and give them lots to choose from. Whatever they don't eat at lunch, they can eat for a snack after school. It's easy to put a lunch together from these basic food groups. Start with reusable containers, and this cuts down on waste and saves you from buying disposables. Fill a stainless steel bottle with half juice and water for a delicious and healthy drink. Today the kids are having carrots and sliced apples for their fruit and vegetable. We give the kids a cookie or a homemade treat and something savory like crackers or pretzels. They usually eat this first. Mike and I work as a team in the morning, and while he makes lunches, I make breakfast. I follow a basic food group idea for breakfast, making sure they have a protein and a grain like French toast. Just blend an egg with a sprinkle of cinnamon and dip your bread to coat and fry till it's golden on both sides. Top with a small pat of butter and maple syrup. I usually serve this with a fruit smoothie. The boys named this one the Weirdo Milkshake. Today Mike is making a grilled cheese sandwich for Skylar and a veggie sausage patty for Davis. Place a slice of cheese between two pieces of bread and fry till it's golden and melted. The sausage is cooked before putting it in the lunchbox and both items should cool slightly before putting them in plastic. Try and buy an insulated lunchbox and use ice packs. Food left unrefrigerated for more than two hours can develop harmful bacteria. This includes meat and vegetarian food. After a healthy breakfast, they're off to school with their homemade lunches. Studies have shown that proper nutrition contributes to a better performance in school. I wish every child could have this advantage. We can try and change the schools, but our first step is to start in our own home.